All right, we are going to be talking to Miss Amber right now, and she is walking into our interview. Right now, you walk in. <laughs> okay, there's no way to not walk into an interview like that wearing some bright pink pumps. She's got the gold. Okay, we get to talk about that first judging panel, the comments. They loved it, loved it, loved it. I mean, how did that feel? Because it was a risk for you. You had talked about it on Tuesday. It was a risk. So getting that reward and having all the judges just absolutely adore it. Like, tell me how that feels as an artist. It feels amazing because, you know, this week I was really nervous about both of my songs. So, I mean, like, once I got really good critique about the first one, I was like, oh, I could do the second one. Like, you know, it's not a thing. So, yeah, it was and, nice. And of all the songs performed tonight, you know, und undoubtedly the second song that you performed for Beyonce's was the youngest one. People your age are actually gonna, you know, pick that up. Um, do you think that's gonna be an advantage for you? Because people watching actually probably knew it. Exactly, yeah, I mean, I feel like it is gonna be a little bit of an advantage, because I mean, it was a current song, everybody knows it, and I had a lot of fun, so I guess, I hope so. <laughs> do you find it hard right now? Because it is, it seems, you know, I don't wanna predict, but it seems like it's a girl's show, and it seems like, you know, one week it will seem like somebody's on top and then they go and it's, it's kind of like this back and forth. I mean, what do you think it's going to take for Amber to just say, you know what, I'm here, I need to win this, let's go. I mean, I feel like I just need to step it up every week, you know, maybe add a few little more elements that America hasn't seen so they can be like, oh, she can do that and she can do that and she can do that. So, I mean, like, it's just all about upping myself. If you were to, if they were to say, do any song you want by any artist, what song do you think would show America like, Oh, now I get it. This is the kind of artist she wants to be, and she has to be in the final. Wow, that is a really tough question to ask me on the spot. You are a singer. <laughs> you know you are in your car 24-7 like, ooh, I would be on Idol singing this. There's a lot of songs that I like, but then it's different when America's judging you because you want to do something that they'll be like, ah, so yeah. I don't know. Can I answer that? Like, Yeah, you can answer it <laughs> next week. Not tomorrow, because if we see you tomorrow, that's bad news. Yeah, so yeah. next week, well, you never want to see us tomorrow. Um, how are you, how are you, like, is attention getting to you yet? Or, or do you find yourself more relaxed? Or is it now that it's top six, you're like, oh, Oh my gosh, I try not to remind myself that this is top six and it's like, get it, get it, get it. You know, I just take it a day at a time and I do what I feel like I need to do. So. And then what would, it, what would it mean if Beyonce, well, she doesn't tweet, but what would it mean if Beyonce Instagrammed a picture of you and saying, you killed it or something like that? Oh my gosh, if she did that, I'd probably like die. They would have to call CPR, like revive me or something. Yeah. But no, that'd be so great. That'd be like an honor. Like she's amazing. And for her to know my name or even look, if she just even watches my video, I would just yeah. die. <laughs> and then lastly, what has been the sweetest thing this last week that maybe a fan tweeted you that you were just like, okay, I may have some hard times, but this really got me through. Oh man, somebody was like, Amber, don't let the hate get to you. Because you know, it's certain people that don't like me and it's certain people that like me, but that person was like, you know, don't let the hate get to you. Keep your head up, you know, you got this, don't worry about it. You know, stuff like that just really makes my day. Because I do feel, I'm, I'm a human being, you know. So yeah. Thank you so much. Hopefully we won't see you tomorrow. We'll see you next week. It was a pleasure. Absolutely. It's a pleasure meeting you too. Or seeing you, not meeting you. I already know you. <laughs> all right. All right oh, yeah, you got to walk out of our interview. Do whatever you want. It is all about you. Walk this way. Okay.